Santa Clara County banned leaded aviation fuel known as Avgas due to its known threat to the environment and the community surrounding Reed Hillview and other regional airports. But now a national decision may reverse the ban and neighbors say it puts our community at risk. This is a, a personal challenge for me or a very uh, difficult topic. I would feel very disillusioned if we if we if they were able to sell um, if they forced us to sell leaded fuel uh, because it would be like a huge step backwards. Two bills in the House and Senate would require Avgas sales to be mandatory at all public airports, even at Santa Clara County airports, which stopped selling the harmful fuel as of January 2022. Supervisor Cindy Chavez aims to stop national lawmakers from reversing the county's work. I'm asking the Santa Clara County administration to continue working at the federal level to stop attempts of the federal government to make leaded fuel mandatory. To help do that, the referral from Supervisor Chavez calls for county staff to continue lobbying for unleaded fuel availability nationwide to create an easier pipeline and transition away from Avgas. It would also push forward planning efforts for a reimagined Reed Hillview site once the airport closes in 2031. We in this community will not go back. We do not want our children poisoned by lead, our, our communities poisoned by lead. Aviation expert Walter Geiger says pilots recognize that unleaded fuel is a better option for the environment and for planes. But until unleaded fuel is widely available and compatible with all aircrafts, he believes Avgas must be sold. It makes absolutely no sense to leave a number of airplanes stranded uh, without the availability of leaded fuel. Uh, it's a small number agreed, but uh, it just creates a lot of uh, problems. The Board of Supervisors will vote on the referral Tuesday. In Santa Clara County, Dustin Dorsey, ABC 7 News.